guys, it's Keegan. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, we are going to be doing my dorm room plan. So I did this video last year when I moved into my dorm my freshman year. Now I'm a sophomore and I'll be moving into my sorority house and the rooms there are dorm style. So I'll have a roommate, I'll have a communal bathroom, blah, 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 all that stuff. So I'll be living in a dorm again. Yay. <laughs> last year I did this video where I basically explained what my idea for my dorm was, like how I plan to decorate it, what I plan to do with the furniture, all that stuff. So you guys seem to really like it. So I thought I would do it again with my dorm and my sorority house. My roommate actually has no idea what I'm doing. I have not told her yet. So hi, if you're watching this, Daniela, here's what I'm planning on doing. You're the best. Love you. Yeah, I'm really hungry. My stomach is about to growl. So I made this mood board that I sent to my mom. So I went through the photos and tried to find it, but I found it now. And it's kind of outdated. I kind of changed a lot. Maybe it's not as up to date, but you guys will get the idea. I will show you guys a little picture right here. Wait, actually, no. I want to like just stop for a moment and just pause the video. I have two giveaways going on right now. One's on my Instagram. It's a $50 Forever 21 gift card. And then one is a YouTube giveaway. Yeah. So I'll have the link down below for that video if you guys want to watch it. You guys can win a ton of cool stuff like a Steve Madden backpack, school supplies, some makeup, fun stuff. Lots of good stuff. So if you guys want to enter either of those, follow me on Instagram and then click the link down below to enter. I just love you guys and I want to get back to you guys and I want you to actually like enter. We're back now. We're back to the video. I will put a picture right here of what the room looks like. I found it on the internet so hopefully you don't get copyrighted. But yeah, that's what the room looks like. Wood floors. It's like a really long slender room and it comes with like a bed, a desk, and like a rocking chair like low-key weird they give you a rocking chair but whatever and then this like low drawer shelves and I think it comes like a little nightstand if I'm not mistaken could be wrong but I think it comes with that so that's the whole room it also has like the mirrored like sliding glass like closet doors so I don't need to bring my full length mirror which is cool last year I really liked how my dorm turned out I thought it was super cute but I wanted to do something different and I wanted to go for like a different color scheme so my color scheme is kind of like white creamish color green and like earthy brown and like maybe peach because I have this really cute blanket that I like but we'll see if we like it in the end. I also did a dorm decor haul if you guys want to see all this stuff in action because some of the stuff that I'm showing you guys I ended up not getting or whatever like just not getting so if you guys want to see what I actually ended up getting go check it out. I already uploaded it so I'll link it down below. Here's my mood board for the room so it's kind of confusing a little bit so I thought we'd kind of like go by it step by step. Let's start with the right corner because I feel like the left is like the exciting part so we'll, we'll make you wait a little bit. The bedding that I have in this photo is actually the bedding I decided not to choose. I didn't go with that bedding. I was really struggling on like what bedding I wanted because I wanted it to not just be like a simple white thing but I wanted there to be like some texture or something but I also didn't want it to be like too overpowering with like my throw blankets and my throw pillows and all that stuff so the one that I went with is in my dorm decor hall but it's white and it has like a little bit of texture but it's mostly just like solid and then above my bed I'm planning on having my Alpha Chi Omega sign. I got it from Social Life. I'm staring at it right now in my corner right there. That was above my bed last year and I really liked it. It was like something to, you know, add something there but it wasn't too much and since I already have it, I don't need to spend money so we love that for us. The pillows, I got none of these pillows but I actually really, the one with like the zigzag thing, I kind of really like it and I kind of want to get it but I don't remember where I found it from. <laughs> that sucks. These are all the pillows. I ended up getting white ones so if you guys again want to see it, go check out my dorm decor haul. I didn't end up getting any of these but these are like the vibe of the pillow that I wanted. Boho, earthy, like lots of texture, you know, just you know over a little bit i have my throw blanket which is the one that i have right here it's so cute that is basically the kind of thing that i'm concerned about because it's not white it has like color in it so i think that i might buy some pillows that have like this peachy like oatmeal color in it so I can kind of like tie that in there but I really like it it's from Urban Outfitters comfy it sheds a lot but it's still comfy and cute that is that so that's kind of like the bedding area and one thing that I don't know about the room so I'll put actually the floor plan of the room right here so as you can see there's like a little indent of the wall where like the door is because you have to like walk in and everything so there's part of the room where there's like a wall and then the other side of the room doesn't hopefully I will get that side of the room that has the wall because that would be like ideal for filming videos because like this natural sunlight and then I'll have like a wall it'll be great hopefully I get it if not then like whatever so if I do get that wall I think I will bring my dresser so this one right here from Ikea I brought this to my dorm last year because my idea was I needed storage for clothes and things like that but I thought that if I bought like clear bins I won't reuse them so I thought you know I'll just buy a dresser now and I can use it for like an apartment or whatever when I get there I have this I really want to bring it because I think it's cute in videos and it stores a ton of stuff it is the oh gosh what's it called it's from Ikea. I forgot the name of it, but it's from Ikea. And I want to bring it, hopefully if that wall is number one, big enough. Number two, if I end up getting there and get that side of the room. Because like if my roommate comes for me, 
can she make it? I should just like ask her if I can have that side of the room, but like I should just do that. Why am I stupid? Anyways, so yeah, I don't know if I want to bring the dresser. I could also put my dresser under my bed and like have bed risers like I did last time. My bed was on top of my dresser, if you guys remember. I'm like touching it. I'm like, hi. <laughs> That's my little dresser thing. So if I do get that side of the room, then I will need to buy decor to put on top of the dresser and decor to put on the wall. But since I don't know yet, I haven't gotten to that point yet. <laughs> okay, so above my bed, this is the exciting part. This is what I'm like so pumped about. I really struggled with this because I was like, I want to do something great because I feel like I needed to top myself because my dorm last year was just so cute and I feel like I've never decorated anything that cute in my life and I was like, okay, well now we need to go above and beyond and make this dorm even cuter and I didn't want the same thing. I went with this, so this is gorgeous. I actually found this on Twitter one day I was scrolling and there was a video of a lady who was cleaning her house. I was watching a video of this girl cleaning her house. Like, I don't know why I was, but I was like, ooh, so satisfying. And in her room, she had this. So, like, this screenshot is literally from her room. And I loved it. I bookmarked it. I saved it. I was like, I want to do this. I found out that she had a blog. And she did a blog about this. I'll link it down below if I can remember. So, all credit to her. Not trying to, like, steal this idea. This is 100% her. I think it's, like, House of Hens or House and Hens, something like that. But I thought it was so cute. So, I got all the stuff to make it. And I actually, this is what they look like. So, this is what I made. They're so cute. I, like, tried to make some ones. And then I, like, taped it to my wall in my bedroom. And then they keep falling because scotch tape does not hold up like this stuff. I think they're so cute and I definitely am excited for it. The walls in the GLV, which is what we call our sorority house, the GLV is a sorority house, they're like a beige neutral color. So I think that'll be cute, like the contrast. And it won't be too much white with like the white bedding and white pillows. This is what they look like. They're super cute. In the photo, she has a smear that says, I love us. But below it, I actually, this picture is directly from her website. I thought this was really cute. I want to get this picture frame. I want to get three of these. They're from Ikea. They're just square picture frames. And then I want to put quotes in them and like this kind of order if you guys see. So the one on the left says just enjoy where you are now. The one in the middle says you can't please everyone so do it yourself. And then the one on the right says collect beautiful moments. I may change these out. I picked these quotes. I found them on Instagram or Pinterest. I found these quotes on Pinterest and I did that. So maybe I will change it because I've recently been like looking at quotes on Pinterest all the time. That is what I want to do. And my only concern is that like I don't want it to overlap the picture frame because as you can see, maybe the picture frame like goes out there, not flat. Like it starts here, but like the thing is here. That made no sense. That is the part that I'm like a little bit concerned about because I don't know if there'll be enough room in between the three picture frames, but we'll see it. I made quite a bit of these, but I haven't made all of them. So I think they're so cute. It'll be very earthy and green and I think it's going to turn out super cute. I also have some decor that I haven't shown you guys yet because they're coming in for like sponsored videos that I'm really excited about. Yeah, that's it. That's all I got. <laughs> so I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. I was very rambly, so I apologize a lot. Again, don't forget to enter my giveaway on Instagram and on YouTube. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one.